Here's a look at what's coming up on today's fossil hunt. Here's a fossil hunt that me and my brother had. We found quite a lot of large nodules which we opened up on the beach, some of which contained some really lovely fossils and others which were totally empty and throughout this video you'll see us opening them up. At the end of the video there's also, which we found on this hunt, one of the first examples of a species we've never found before called a Pleurocerus. It's incredible quality and we were so pleased to find it. The first nodule we're going to open is this one. It's a pretty big nodule and you can already see the edge of a Harposerus ammonite around it. The majority of the specimen is revealed almost immediately, but Shea is now going to reveal the rest of it. Oh, wow! It's really nice. Now that we opened that nodule, we're going to have a look around and see what else we can find. We've already got a few nodules put to one side that we picked up earlier in the day, and so we'll be opening those as well. That's a big chunky one. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
cross section of one in there. Might be a few little ones with it. You never know. This is another pretty large pyritic nodule. You can see a few ammonites already inside it. Sometimes these nodules open really well and other times they don't. But we thought we we're going to give it a go anyway and see what happens. Yet. No. Of the bits of the nodule that we did manage to break off, we couldn't really see any fossils inside. We had to abandon the rest of this nodule because it was just too difficult to open up. Next we're going to open up some of the nodules we found earlier in the day and then we've got the biggest nodule of all to open up. This is by far the biggest nodule that we found. Fingers crossed it has something nice inside. Again, this is one of the nodules which is really pyritic and difficult to open and just emphasizes the fact that you need to wear safety goggles if you're ever doing anything like this. All sorts of little bits of stone flying up everywhere. Unfortunately, there was absolutely nothing whatsoever inside this nodule. 
Although we managed to open it, there just wasn't anything inside. But next we're going to have a look at one of the really rare ammonites that we've... I think it's the only one we've ever found, or at least the only one ever of this quality. It's a Pleuroceros and is really rare, and is one that will be going straight into our collection once we've prepared it. Such a beautiful ammonite, lots of lovely colours on it, and it's really chunky as well. I'm going to have a look at it and then wash it in the sea to help show off some of the lovely colours on it. I really hope you've enjoyed watching this video, thank you for watching, and next up is a little clip about how to get some fossils of your own, and in return support the channel. So thank you very much and I'll see you in the next episode. That's amazing!